Hey y'all, today we're going to be doing this candy cane smush manicure. I'm starting with a white base of Cuccio Florence Frenzy and I'm going to be using Big Island Volcano from Island Girl, Salsa Dance from Salon Perfect, and Internationally Known from Pure Ice. This is the stamp and plate I'll be using and this image right here. I'm going to start by doing a little tiny bullseye on my Born Pretty mat and I'm just going to start with white, then I'm going to put the pearly white in there and I'm putting two drops of that and only one drop of red because otherwise the red will take over this whole design so just put one drop of red and then I'm going to put some more white and some more of the pearl white as well then I'm going to take a clear jelly stamper and I'm just going to smush that all together and there you can see it right here on the stamper and then I'm just going to start smushing it all over my nail and I'm just doing this until I get the desired look that I want. You can have more red, more white, more whatever you want. But just do it until you're happy with what you have. Then I'm going to take the green color and I'm going to put this on the image on the Stampin' Plate. And we're just going to scrape this towards me. Or towards you. <laughs> and pick it up with another clear jelly stamper or you can use the same one but i'm just using a different one and i'm going to take my lint roller and i'm just going to take off everything on the stamper that is not the design that i want just to help with easier cleanup but you can do whatever you would like to do and you can use liquid latex but we all know how lazy i am and i just use acetone so sue me <laughs> Then I'm just going to take it and I'm going to line it up over my nail at an angle as you can see my other finger and we're just going to lay that down on top of the nail and get those green stripes on there. You can see through the stamper there. And at this point if you get a little line like I did where it's not fully across the nail if you have any left on the other side of the stamper you can go back in and just fill in that same line you see how I just did that right there just filled in that line and now it's perfect then go ahead and clean your stamper with a piece of tape or a lint roller so you don't mess it up with acetone I'm gonna go in with my small brush and some acetone and clean up the polish on the skin Again, you could use liquid latex, tape, whatever barrier you would like. And then I'm going to finish everything off with my favorite top coat, which is the Crystal Clear Top Coat by Salon Perfect. And that's it. I hope y'all enjoy these. I really love the way this turned out. I haven't done a smushy mani in forever. And I was doing a design the other day and it just didn't turn out. And it was kind of like this. So I just wanted to do a kind of recreation. So if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Be sure to hit that subscribe button. Thanks so much for watching and I'll catch you guys next time. Bye!